Good evening and welcome to Night Prayer. Gather with the one who knows and calls us chosen. So let's take a moment or two, knowing that his call is the same today for us as it was yesterday and will be tomorrow. Psalm 67 verse 1, may God be gracious to us and bless us and make his face shine upon us that your ways may be known on earth, your salvation among all nations. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. We bring again to him the things of this day, the things that we need his help with, the things that we give thanks for. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. A verse from Psalm 26, verse 1. Vindicate me, O Lord, for I have led a blameless life. I have trusted in the Lord and have not faltered. Vindicate me, O Lord, for I have led a blameless life. I've trusted in you. This verse from Psalm 26 of David, calling out, vindicate me, stand up for me. Lord, it all seems too much, seems to be what he's saying. We know that David was challenged by in so many ways by Saul, in his um, pursuit of him. And David's calling out, Lord, help. I've done my best. I've followed you. Help, this isn't what I expected. And I expect we've all been there. God does not promise us a life free from trouble, free from evil. And that's what David is facing. And he calls out to God, help. Will you be the one who stands for me? You know what I've done. You know how I've tried to follow you. Help. In those situations where we feel the same, it's encouraging and comforting to know that we can call out and say to God, help, vindicate me, stand up for me. It doesn't seem fair. We've all, I expect, been in those places. God knows. He is at work. And it doesn't show a lack of faith for us to shout to him. Let's pray. Loving God, there are times when we don't understand what's going on. And we cry to you. Will you vindicate us? Will you stand for us? Will you make a way where everything seems to be on top of us? Lord, help us to keep our eyes on you through the challenging situations that life throws. As we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Merciful God, we entrust to your unfailing and tender care this night, all who are ill or in pain. Knowing that whenever danger threatens, your everlasting arms are there to hold us safe. Comfort and heal each one. Restore them to health and strength through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. And together we pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. 
your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and for ever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. And so now may God, the one who stands with you and for you, assure you that he will not let your foot slip. Amen. Bless you and sleep well. <laughs>